Welcome to my shower routine. Let's get started. So I'm going to start off by pinning my hair up and making sure that it is out of my face. Starting by using this Dove Sensitive Skin Soap. And this soap is fragrance free and hypoallergenic. During these months, my skin needs a little bit of extra care, so I go in with this soap, and it is perfect for dry skin as well. I do use this on my vajay area as well. It is for sensitive skin, so you can use it down there. Just make sure that you guys are only washing the outside and you're not washing the inside. And this soap is super moisturizing, so you don't have to worry about this soap drying out your skin or drying out your vajay area down there at all. I'm going to go in with this bump eraser body scrub from first aid beauty and if you guys struggle with bag acne or just acne over your body or bumps on your legs bumps on your arms your back anywhere over your body then this would be a great scrub for you guys to try out and this is how it looks as I'm applying it to my skin it's an exfoliator and it is for sensitive skin. So if you have sensitive skin, then you should definitely try out this product. However, using this product, I feel like after I use it, my skin is very dry. So you want to make sure that you're following up with something moisturizing after you use this product. Now I'm going to go in with some shave cream so that I can shave my arms and my legs. I only have to shave about once or twice a month, but I'm going in with this refreshments shave cream. And this is a vegan shave cream, so it's free of parabens, sulfates. It doesn't have any of that in it, and it's um, cruelty free. And it is dermatologist tested. So this shave cream does have a lot of oils in it, so it is moisturizing and nourishing to the skin. shaving I recommend that you guys use a men's razor so I've been doing this little trick since like high school when I discovered it so the men's razor is angled at a different position than the women's razor so for me it feels like it's a sharper blade it just gets my hair off way better than the woman's um razor so the one the women's razor I feel like I have to go over it multiple times the men's razor I only have to go through it about once and it's gone. Next, I'm going to be taking my You're the Ones Bath and Body Work Moisturizing Body Wash. And you guys, when I tell you this stuff smells good, this stuff smells so good and it is super duper moisturizing so it has shea butter coconut oil and cocoa butter in here you guys and the fragrant notes of this body wash smells so good it will leave your bathroom smelling so so good i also love that this body wash is very thick and it is very creamy it's very nourishing to my skin it feels very moisturizing which i need all the moisture i can get and i love it
know you are a million rock. I didn't have my socks on. Coming up from my arm. And I shoot that arm. go in with this foot scrub and it has a mint scent and this foot scrub is very exfoliating to my feet you guys so my feet need a little bit of extra TLC during this time I'm not gonna lie okay it's need a little bit of extra TLC so we're gonna make that happen for this scrub you have to be a part of a community to get it however I will link um, something similar in the description box it also comes with a foot lotion and this smells like peppermint as well and it's very nourishing and moisturizing as well it has a lot of um, shea butter cocoa butter mango butters it's very rich and also acts as a skin conditioner for your feet and I would recommend that you put on socks after this so that you can lock in all that moisture. I'm going to be using my Coconut Oil by Organics Body Mist and my Nivea Essentially Enriched. And I'm going to mix those two together. So you guys can do this as well. So this is how we're going to get that glowy skin that we love, okay? So you guys can already see the glow just glistening off of my arms. Just look, just look at it glisten. And I'm going to do the same exact things for my legs. go in with a body gel and this one is from Equate and it is called Coco Divine and this body gel is just going to lock in and seal all of that lotion and body mist that we just did and you guys can even see you guys this is this is much more glowy so if you guys want to stop at the first step you can however I like to take it a step further and be just a little bit extra glowy you know Next, I'm going to go in with my Refreshments Deodorant, and this is a vegan product as well, cruelty-free, no parabens and sulfates, and this one is in Pacific Fizz, and it smells really, really good. This deodorant is also aluminum-free, and also it's baking soda-free, and it just leaves my underarms feeling very fresh. Now to top this all off, I have to use this floral pear by Dozier. Um, this is inspired by Jo Malone's English pear and Frisia cologne. And it smells so, so good, you guys. Oh my God. So a tip that I learned is to not rub your perfumes in. Just let them sit. However, I'm going to rub this in. Um, <laughs> so Dozier is an affordable perfume brand that has all of your favorite dupes so you guys it is made in france and they also sent another scent for us to try and this is the tom ford's oud wood this is more of a masculine scent so those here also uses vegan ingredients for all of their perfumes and products now they have candles those here just keeps getting better and better but they also sell men fragrances, men colognes on their website. If you don't want to break the bank by purchasing your designer perfumes and you want something a little bit affordable, it is $29 per bottle. Sometimes it's a little bit more. And if you guys purchase three bottles, you get free shipping. So make sure you guys go check out Dozy here. Thank you guys so much for watching my shower routine. See you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.